I will check back with y'all again later. <laughs> Teddy, are you comfy cozy? Are you comfy cozy? We're just gonna leave you there while we go to the visitor center real quick, okay? He's away. He don't care. He's like, I'm just chilling. Teddy, are you ready for adventures? <laughs> mountains back there. It's early morning so the mountains are super foggy and really pretty. So we just finished doing a tour at the McDonald's Observatory right outside of Fort Davis. I'm gonna show you all that now. Some views from the top of the mountain. We went to the highest summit in Texas. Beautiful views of the mountains. You can see the mountains here. It's so pretty out here.
And now we're stopped at this little picnic area to eat some snacks. And then we're gonna go back through Marfa to get to the Prada store and have a little photo shoot. Rainbow carrots, hummus, and some dried fruit. We found the Prada store. The Prada store in the middle of the desert. It's an art installation. Not sure why or how or who put it out here, but yeah, Prada Marfa. to the next location. So we were driving down the road and we saw these random holes with like alien-esque looking lights on them. finally got back to our Airbnb. It's about 8 o'clock at night. We just came from seeing the Marfa lights. We did get to see the Marfa lights and I tried to film it, but my camera couldn't pick it up. If I did actually catch it, I'm gonna insert that here. I still can't get it on camera. <laughs> Dang it. You may be watching it, you may be just like, not. If you don't know what the Marfa lights are though, they're like, these floating orbs of light off in the distance that move irregularly and there's a bunch of different theories about them. I was reading up on some of the science earlier and um, a lot of people think they're creepy. I didn't think they were creepy. It was kind of cool to see them, but it was super cold out there. So I'm so glad to be back in this Airbnb. All right, I'm gonna go make dinner. For dinner, I made a rice and bean Buddha bowl with rainbow char, some vegan cheese. I'm about to dig into this. We didn't have lunch, so I'm starving. Finally finished some work I had to get done tonight. Finally in comfy clothes, my Harry Potter pajamas. It is 11 o'clock, I'm so tired. I think 
I'm gonna do a quick before bed stretch and then I'm going to go to sleep. Tomorrow we're leaving. That's kind of sad, but I will be happy to get home. All right, good night. It is eight o'clock next day. We're just getting the car packed up. I think we're actually gonna head out pretty early um, and try and hit the tiny target on the way home. The just building that's not actually a target, but somebody painted the word target on it and painted the bullseye. Leaving Marfa, Texas. Daddy. found it! We found the tiny target! Aww! It's all tagged up and trashed in here! Those are really pretty. My mom and Teddy are on their way back to Houston right now, but I am in my apartment putting everything away, unpacking, and now it's time to relax and start editing. Don't forget to like and subscribe, hit that notification bell, and follow me on Instagram and Twitter. I'm going to be posting some pictures from Marfa on Instagram over the next couple weeks if I don't already have those up. And also, Sign up for my recipe email list. There's a link down in the description, but I send out recipe emails every other week. I think the next one is going to be the food we ate while we were traveling. So if you're interested in that, in what's easy to cook in an Airbnb, sign up for the recipe email down below. All right, I hope y'all enjoyed this little vlog in Marfa, Texas, and I'll see y'all next week. Bye y'all.